Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Eating Out Down Under. We are just standing at the South Perth jetty, and behind me the ferry is about to disembark, um, heading through to the city, which you can see there behind me. We've got a really special one for today, and uh, to be honest, I'm a little bit terrified. I'm not 100% sure how it's going to go. But uh, I guess I guess we're just going to have to see. Uh, we're headed through to the Windsor Hotel to try their spicy chicken challenge. They've got some ridiculously spicy chicken wings. Uh, eight minutes to have eight wings, and you've got to do it within the time frame. Eat the whole lot, otherwise uh, you don't win anything. If, however, you are able to accomplish the task, you will win yourself a $100 bar tab at the Windsor to enjoy um, in celebration of your win. So, guys, uh, hopefully, um, I'm feeling pretty confident I've actually got Dylan Henry with me today uh, he's gonna be tackling it with me and uh, yeah we're gonna see how we can we can go I've been thinking about it all night sat up last night sort of thinking of strategies that I'm gonna employ I'm gonna try attack it in a certain way I'm not gonna give anything away yet but if you guys follow us there you will see how it all pans out welcome to this episode let's get going As I'm standing here in the kitchen just after the wings have gone down to fry, I'm already being hit with some, I don't know, some foul air, or I believe it's that chili getting straight into me, already getting to work on my lungs. I've been coughing, my eyes are starting to water a little bit. Here we go, here's one coming on now. <coughs> And boy, does that terrify me ever the more. Am I really going to put these in my body? Stay tuned to find out. chicken has arrived and as you can see we're about to tuck into it but before we even got close to touching it the staff came right over to us and they've uh, handed us a pair of gloves each so that we don't burn our fingers. Uh, I'm about to put something in my body that could potentially harm my hands. I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, not only that but I've got to sign a disclaimer here. Essentially if we die and that's the end of us, uh, well, the Windsor will take no responsibility. Guys, if this is the final episode of Eating Out Down Under, know that I went down doing something I love, and that's eating chicken. And there it is, guys. I have now signed that uh, potentially I could die today, and I'm okay with that. I think I'm okay with that. <laughs> <laughs> this is Anna, and uh, Anna, what, what, what uh, role do you do? Here. I'm the marketing manager at the Windsor. Oh, there we go, the marketing manager. And does she not know how to do her job, guys? Because uh, we're here doing something silly that I never thought I'd ever do. Anna has got a timer with her there, and she's going to be timing us, making sure that we don't overstep our boundaries and we keep within the eight minute limit. And, um, you know, I've sort of planned a strategy. Hopefully, I can execute. I'm not sure you guys are going to find out. But apparently, regardless of what strategy I choose to employ, there needs to be just bones left on this board by the time I'm done. Can I handle it? You're about to find out. Yeah, bro. So let's dig in. Three, two, one. Okay. Let's see how this You can see horse has just jumped straight in, but I'm leading in with a bit of strategic thinking here, hoping that it will allow me to pull away at the end. Who knows? He isn't crying yet, so that's a good sign. It's bloody hot. This is hard, I'm one wing in, and I want to die. <laughs> that is hot, man. Don't let my calm demeanor fool you. I'm dying, I'm crying. Good. 
How many wings are you in? I don't know. <laughs> it's best not to think about it. I want to win this bar tab, guys. I'm doing this for you. Oh, I'm out. Very good effort from you. Very good effort. Oh, God. Oh, dude. <laughs> this is a lot harder than it looks guys, I'm, I'm actually crying right now. My mouth is on fire. How long left coach? Oh. So you're 4.30 and you've got three and a half minutes to go. Right. Someone save me, I need a beer. Oh. I need something to drink. Oh. Oh. oh, my mouth is on fire. Don't touch your eyes. Oh. 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 There you go, buddy. Oh, you, looks like you just uh, nearly there. Oh. All right, we're gonna get the official word from the judge. Let me know, mate, how have I done? Oh, that is the worst thing I've ever done in my life, but you've let done, me move out of the way. You've done very well, but there are unfortunately pieces still there, which means... I don't win! <laughs> no! No! No. Thank you so much for having me, mate. That was, oh, I Just can't so, talk. Let's get some more tissues for you, shall we? Get a, get a beer. So how's the, how's the burn? Oh. They don't call it the afterburn for nothing, do they? <laughs> <laughs> My mouth is completely on fire, guys. I right, let's get a close up. This is what I look like. Oh. oh my goodness! That hurts so much, but there, yeah, guys. This. It's been one heck of an episode of Eating Out Down Under. Stay fresh. 